Simon specifically told just a little backstory. Simon specifically told me not to tell him who Lord King was. Lord King's PR in New Mexico, right? I have no idea. Where he was? He's PR somewhere. I yeah, it's New, it's New Mexico. That's why he's got the NM right there. Um, but he was specific. I was like, oh, you fight Lord King, bro. So I want that on stream. And he's like, yeah, yeah, yeah. He specifically told me not to tell him. Well, that let's he was PR or let's anything. See how, uh, see how it pans out for Simon. I know, you know, he's kind of like. He's got a strong combo game, you know, mm -hmm. uh, and I, I find he's usually pretty solid at sealing the stocks, you know, so that's kind of one of his main benefits as a player. And right here you can- s Oh! oh. I, oh I jinxed it. I'm sorry, Simon! <laughs> I actually jinxed it. He I'm seeing the wrong yeah, way. One direction away from taking it. I think his pressure- his, his, his nerves are up, though. Yeah. His nerves are up. You know, uh, he could still definitely, you know, he's not behind by too much, but this combo from Lord King, you know, Pal is not exactly considered like a combo character, but she still has those early percent, you know, those Nair trains, yeah. or Nair planes, I should say. You get you up high and right points. now, Ooh. he's just up there, just straight up pressure. No, no, uh, no air dodge reads or anything. He's just swinging for the fences. Mm -hmm. And why not? When you have a lead, you know? You might as well go for that uh, balls the extra credit. And Lord King is the type of player that'll do that, you know. As far as Palutena's go, one of the ones that kind of likes to press the most buttons. But that up smash will seal it out anyway. Simon looks like he's getting back in the zone. Being a little bit more careful about just pressing buttons, he was uh, kind of just... Yep. Oh, go to DI that... Uh, make sure you DI that down throw out. He tried to get the back air grab, but didn't get the back air first. Oh, ooh, that'll do it. You know, it, it's really unfortunate because he really had that stock burst, yeah. but then he kind of lost all his momentum when, when he uh, missed it. Now he needs to see if he can get it back, and this could be pretty good for that. You get a little bit up air happy with the sort of up airing through the shield. You need a little bit more uh, empty hop or whatever to try and bait the nair out. Because you know, the nair ass shield will catch the up up there if he does it through the shield like that yeah. so he's trying to get those ladders yeah he's not quite specifically going for those up airs but it's not quite connecting I think he's not uh, quite getting the right uh like the falling one on the platform he's getting like the rising one mm -hmm. which isn't quite correct you know it's kind of hard though Lord King's not making it easy Ooh. you need to wait a little bit longer if you're gonna punish a spot dodge like that good air dodge in Forward throw, take the stage control. Not a bad plan by any means. Ooh. He's looking for the air dodge, or the, I mean the uh, up smash, but you know, Lord King not giving it to him. Him that one, but at that point is staled on shield and kind of far out. Keeps getting caught by the explosive flame. Yeah, well it's hard as Mario, you know, he doesn't really have a plethora of landing options. He's kind of stuck to a handful. Oh, right there. Oh, okay. You know what? I stand corrected. Now, uh, this is... Oh, you gotta DI that away! Look, Palu will never kill you with forward throw. The forward throw does not go anywhere. So don't worry about DIing in. If you get grabbed, you know, if it's not a pivot grab, and she grabs you when she's facing the ledge, just hold out. Because if she forward throws you, you're not gonna die. And if she down throws you, you're not gonna die. <laughs> but don't, don't hold in. That will lead to you getting smacked. Those are words that have never been said. Now, if she turn, if she does like a pivot grab, you hold in <laughs> because <laughs> that's the complete opposite. Yeah, She's going for a back throw. Death. And likewise, if you hold in when she's facing away from the ledge, you will never die if you hold in. So, I mean, unless it's just it's too much percentage for the back throw, the DI won't save you. Simon's trying to land pretty aggressively right now, too. Yeah. I mean, yeah. He's kind of like... He wants to get these openings, but Loki's kind of sitting in shield. Maybe he needs to go for, like, some tomahawk grabs or something. You know, really just grabbing in general. I think it would be pretty beneficial for him. Because he keeps trying to do, like, these up airs through the shield, mm -hmm. you know, sort of. Trying to catch, like, a jump from Lord King or something. But Lord King's not going to give it to him. He's just going to, like, uh... Yeah, he's gonna hold shield, then get the Nair out of yeah. shield. 
Yep. So definitely want to see more grabs from Simon. Less aerials. Because these aerials are getting him blown up right now. Well, he's not quite following up right either. It's just, uh, you know. Okay, this is good. Oh, good DI from Lord King going away from the platform, knowing that that's where Simon can't quite oh. reach. Oh, once again, you know, he's really... Lord King's either holding shield or just moving out of the way of these aerials. Mm -hmm. He's not feeling threatened by them at all. Oh. He's holding a shield there. DI out! <laughs> Come on, man! Yeah, it seems oh. like his, his head doesn't seem 100% in the game right now. He's just kind of uh, making the same mistakes over and over again. Yeah, he's not adapting. He's costing him big time. That dare will not quite do it. That will do it, though. Lurking definitely going for the uh, ledge cancel there, but the flood kind of pushing him back enough to where he couldn't quite snag it. Put the aerials away! <laughs> yeah, I think you're right. Uh, has, he, has he grabbed? No, he, he has not grabbed. Yeah. Come on. We need some grabs from Simon right now. It's it's very important because he's not making any headway with these aerials. Dude, he's, he's just not it, but... he's not going to run into your aerials. You can't expect him to run into your aerials every time. Yeah, yeah, he's He's just, he's like aerialing in front of him, like expecting Lord King to like jump into it, but he's just not going to jump into it. He he's lingering. shown time and time yeah. again that he's not going to jump into it. So you have to be able to adapt to that, you know? If Lord King's going to sit there and hold shield every time, just run up and grab him, you know? Yeah. It's not like Paolo really has like really fast out of shield options. The fastest one is Nair, and I don't think it's going to be fast enough to like deal with a quick grab. So, yeah, I would love to have seen more grabbing. It did look like he was just repeating the same mistakes over and over for those last two. Just up air on shield, up air on shield. Even the down air. And a lot of them weren't even hitting good. Lord King's shield. Like, you'd do it in front of him, mm -hmm. and Lord King would just stand there and wait. And just nair. Yep. He was just getting out aerialed. Yeah, it was just the patience from Lord King. Yep. And Simon kind of making the same mistakes, you know, falling for the same stuff. You mm -hmm. got to be able to adapt in that situation.